Hey everyone, it's Eddie Sanchez and I'm back with more information for you young creatives out there. So today I'm going to be talking about preparation and organization for your film shoot. If you're interested in that kind of stuff, stay tuned. Okay, so let's get into it. So today I want to talk about being organized. Why is it important to be organized when you're making a film? If you're thinking that you're just going to go off by the seat of your pants and, and not be organized, you're in for a lot of uh, heartache. Uh, last week, for example, I had an AC, assistant camera person, uh, kind of cancel. They said they can't make the shoot. It's not personal. This happens all the time. Um, like, uh, like somebody told me once, making a film is like a, like a small miracle, right? Because you have a lot, of, a lot of things have to come together in order for it to happen. Even if it is a short film, a lot of things have to come together in order to, in, in, and people have to work together in order to make it happen. If somebody's sick or somebody quits, you're in trouble, right? The whole thing falls apart. So, like I said, somebody canceled on me, like they couldn't work. Uh, they gave me enough uh, notice that I can actually go and staff me up and hire somebody else. So that worked out. But this happens all the time. You'll get somebody quitting on you. And, you know, don't panic. Just think about it and, and stay focused on what your main goal is, which is to get the film done. Okay, so that's all part of being organized. Uh, I suggest getting a checklist of things that need to be done before you get on set. Um, and what I mean is make sure you know the props that you'll need. Um, sometimes it's hard unless you are at the location looking around and thinking, what do I need for this thing? But just try to visualize what you're going to need for the day of filming. Okay. All right. So I like to write things down, right? Um, a checklist of props. So I go on uh, final draft. Um, you know, I go through all my props, right? And... I just write them down, all the props that I need. But uh, if you wanna, you know, do it on a Word Word document or something like that, and be even more organized, that's even better. A lot of stuff I just, I'm, I remember, <laughs> but I do write down the, the props because sometimes it's a lot of stuff you need to have uh, for the actors, wardrobe and stuff like that. Um, usually when it's a bigger budget, you have assistants, um, an assistant to help you kind of like, uh, help you stay organized. But in this case, I'll have an assistant on the day, the days that I'm shooting, but not right now. As you see, I have a lot of stuff because there's a lot of gear that goes into what's well, props <laughs> and, and gear to make sure of gear back there. So I will, I'm, I'm renting out. So this stuff is going to another car because I'm renting out a car for, for the days of the shoot because I need a bigger car to get stuff around, um, you know, to transfer the, the equipment. Um, besides my equipment, I have to take the gaffer's equipment to set. Uh, there's so much equipment that needs to be used to, to make a film, okay? I'm not going to get into the details, but I spend a lot of money for this film, even though it's a short film, because I want to make sure it's done right, right? If somebody needs something, I make sure I get it just to make sure everything runs smoothly. Okay, but with that being said, um, don't try to wing it when you wing it. You're going to have a lot of issues that go along with it. Make sure that you're organized. You know everything you need uh, for the day of the shoot. Um, so there's no surprises. Uh, make sure you check with your crew. Email your crew. Make sure that they're still good for that shoot date. If not, you have to replace them, unfortunately. It's not personal. It's business. Okay? It's <laughs> Hollywood is a business. Okay? All right. Um, yeah, if you guys have any questions on filmmaking, uh, you know, screenwriting, the process of making a film drop a comment down below i'm always here to help as always thank you subscribe to my youtube channel don't forget i need subscribers and i'll see you guys next video Thanks.